every year we see more and more people getting their news and information from social media. So Facebook, Twitter, increasingly sites like Pinterest, we're watching things like Snapchat with a lot of interest to see how those are shaping the ways people communicate and receive information. Um, and it's really shrunk down because most people get the information on their mobile phones. How many of you use Facebook on your phone? Okay, that's pretty typical. Um, I, I use Facebook more than most people. That was true <laughs> even before I worked there. Um, but I, I've had to actually read it in a little bit because I was one of those annoying people and I actually did it here just now and I apologize to my table where I just have my kind of nose in it all the time. But when I'm waiting for the bus, when I'm waiting for a meeting, you name it, I'm probably scrolling through Facebook to see what's going on in the world and I'm not alone. I think it's become fairly typical for people to spend a lot of time on their phones. Um, one out of every five minutes online is spent on Facebook or Instagram. So we're, we, we do dominate the conversation in terms of what people are seeing. Um, and again, this demonstrates the shift to mobile um, over the last few years and how important you know, cellular service is to this equation. So when you're thinking about your content and what pe how people are seeing, what you're posting, remember that it's showing up on the screen.